In this video, we're gonna show you how to take advantage of the golden letter. Now, this is something we've been sharing on the Pivot Shift Ahead Facebook group. So if you have not joined this group yet, I highly encourage you. We do a morning call every day with James Shaw, Monday through Friday. It's a community, we would invite you, and it's open to all agents no matter where you are. Now, one of the big things we've been talking about the last couple months is really what's called the golden letter. This is a letter I'm gonna share with you in a moment that has allowed people to send it out to their database and neighbors and different people and it's getting listings. So if you're in the Pivot Shift Ahead group, you find this by going to the search button and just typing in golden letter. You will find three versions of it and this is your ability to really find that file it's under more in files, I should say, and find the materials for this golden letter. Now you're able to download it. There's this version. Here's just a text file of chat we had. And then this is another version as well. So this is what the letter was. It's simply a letter you send out to everybody that's saying, I'm looking for a favor. The real estate market's hot. Interest rates are low. The challenge is none of homes for sale. You guys get the idea. So here's our favor. Who do you know who might be thinking of moving in the next 30 to 90 days? And could you introduce us, right? So that's the concept. Now I've taken this as well. And this is one of the ones that we had with the Jack Smith group. He just branded it with the luxury logo and his information, put in the information here below and then ended it with the three team members of his to send it out to people. So that's a way there. Now I've also used command to make my own version of this. So I will share with you if you are in the design system on KW and command, we go to the create designs button and choose print. You will find the option under general for the letterhead. So if you're looking for a letterhead with Keller Williams or the logo, now again, there's no wrong way to do this. You can do this with paper and writing it out and copying that. You can do it in multiple ways. So we're gonna come under basics and choose letterheads. Now here's an option to choose a letterhead with Kella Williams. Make sure it is the letterhead that you wanna use. Now I've already done this for simplicity and I literally went to the letter and I selected all this text. There we go. And I just copied it. And then when I was in my design, I added a text box and I pasted it. That's it. That's how I was able to edit it. And what I did differently is I went ahead and added my logos at the bottom right here so that I can then print this out, have it branded. Again, I think this would look fine without the branding and just add your business card. I'm also printing this in my office on nicer paper, putting it in a colored envelope and sending it out to people. And then it's my opportunity to generate potential listing opportunities by not asking them to sell, asking them who do they know looking to sell that we have buyers looking that are willing to pay top dollar. So that's how you can then use this. So we're taking the idea from here, we're putting it into fruition. You can literally just print this letter as it is, by the way, if you got it and just sign at the bottom and send it. However, if you want to brand it, you can do that as well. And then you can also add information like my version was. Now, the final step of this is how do you follow up with it? Because this is a great opportunity for follow up. So as James shares with us, we want to make sure it's not just send the letter and forget it. How do you follow up with them? So if you come to the smart plans, we're excited that Nakia had shared with us an option to share the golden letter. And you can actually come to library and search golden letter and you will find a couple versions. Now, here's one from Matt Brown, one from Hope, and you'll see 271 agents are using this one, and then 135 are using this version. So either one that you choose, I'm gonna go ahead and rate this, because these are awesome smart plans. One of them is gonna be a basic email with just no um, like fluff, just the text, and then one of them is going to be personalized using the design template. Now, here's some tricks. You're gonna to wanna to go to view steps and look at them and this will show you it is five days of follow-ups. So it is gonna be an email asking the same thing. It's literally copy and paste the, the letter and have it in an auto email that comes from command. Next, it's gonna wait two days and send an auto text saying, hey, I just wanted to follow up and see if you got the email I said. If you know of anyone, let me know. Then wait two days and call them. Now you can have this repeat itself. You can take this plan and customize it. That's what I love. The other version is really the same thing. The only difference is there is an email that you're gonna to wanna to customize first and then use a template and design. So this one takes a little bit more work. For this example, let's just use the golden letter email and follow up. So I'm gonna say add to smart plan, my golden letter email follow up system, and I'm gonna click download. 
Now, don't just leave it as it is. You need to personalize this. So here it is, my golden letter, and you're going to want to come over to the edit button. And the reason you're going to edit it is it might not have your information if you don't. So I've already got a favor, dot, dot, dot. Can you help? It's got my email address here. And then here's the email. Hi, first name. We'd like to ask you a favor, right? Everything we just said in the letter, we always appreciate your gratitude. And then it is an autofill. So technically, you can leave it as it is. Agent's first name, agent last name, and the link to your app would go there. Then it's going to wait two days and be an auto text message. Now, I've got Twilio, so mine is going to connect and send it automatically. If you don't, it is a manual reminder to send it out. So, hi, first name, last name. Here, just wanted to follow up with an email I sent a couple days ago. If anyone comes to mind, let me know. Have a great day. Then it's going to wait two days and remind me to call them. Now, you have a choice on the right-hand side to add more things to this or be done. So you can add another delay. So let's say I want to add a delay to this and maybe after I call, I didn't get them. Maybe I wait two days or three days and then I might want to send another text message. Buyers are still struggling to find a home that meets their needs. Who do you know looking to sell so we can help the families find the right home and help sellers get top dollar. Same kind of concept we had before and wing, there we go. And that would just be my way here and I can even just say J. Awesome, so that can go out. And like I said, you can add a couple of these if you wanna modify it. Once you're done, you click save and there you go. Now you can use this with your database you can then add people to the smart plan. So it's here. I can come to the add a contact. Maybe I want to add myself just to see what this looks like. I always recommend you do that. Why not test it with yourself? So I've got a couple versions of J. I'm just going to choose this one, add the smart plan, and I can start it right now and confirm. It's going to say Twilio OK. Hit confirm, and it would have emailed it over to myself. And you can always copy this, duplicate this, enhance it, but the money's gonna be in the follow-up. So as a recap, come to the Pivot Shift Ahead group. We would love to have you be a member, join us in our community. You can go to file and look for the golden letter. You will find these two examples. This one is really a print and ready to go. This one's got some branding to give you an idea of how to enhance yours. And as I've shared, I've actually done this in designs as well and made my own version of the same thing. Then you're going to go to Smart Plans to make sure there's a follow-up system. Don't just send it and forget it. Hope you found value in this video. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to follow me on KB Connect. You can follow me on YouTube and join me on the Pivot Shift Ahead Facebook group.